secularism is the principle of the separation of government institutions and persons mandated to represent the state from religious institutions and religious dignitaries. One manifestation of secularism is asserting the right to be free from religious rule and teachings, or, in a state declared to be neutral on matters of belief, from the imposition by government of religion or religious practices upon its people. Another manifestation of secularism is the view that public activities and decisions, especially political ones, should be uninfluenced by religious beliefs and or practices. Secularism draws its intellectual roots from Greek and Roman philosophers such as Marcus Aurelius and Epicurus. From Enlightenment thinkers such as Denis Diderot, Voltaire, Baruch Spinoza, James Madison, Thomas Jefferson, and Thomas Paine and from more recent free thinkers and atheists such as Robert Ingersoll and Bertrand Russell. The purposes and arguments in support of secularism vary widely. In European laicism, it has been argued that secularism is a movement toward modernization, and away from traditional religious values. This type of secularism, on a social or philosophical level, has often occurred while maintaining an official state church or other state support of religion. In the United States, some argue that state secularism has served to a greater extent to protect religion and the religious from governmental interference, while secularism on a social level is less prevalent. Within countries as well, differing political movements support secularism for varying reasons. Overview The term secularism was first used by the British writer George Jacob Hilliawak in 1851. Although the term was new, the general notions of free thought on which it was based had existed throughout history. Halayawak invented the term secularism to describe his views of promoting a social order separate from religion, without actively dismissing or criticizing religious belief. An agnostic himself, Halayawak argued that secularism is not an argument against Christianity, it is one independent of it. It does not question the pretensions of Christianity. It advances others. Secularism does not say there is no light or guidance elsewhere, but maintains that there is light and guidance in secular truth, whose conditions and sanctions exist independently, and act forever. Secular knowledge is manifestly that kind of knowledge which is founded in this life, which relates to the conduct of this life, conduces to the welfare of this life, and is capable of being tested by the experience of this life. Barry Cosman of the Institute for the Study of Secularism in Society and Culture breaks modern secularism into two types, hard and soft secularism. According to Cosmin, the hard secularist considers religious propositions to be epistemologically illegitimate, warranted by neither reason nor experience. However, in the view of soft secularism, the attainment of absolute truth was impossible and therefore skepticism and tolerance should be the principal and overriding values in the discussion of science and religion. State Secularism In political terms, secularism is a movement towards the separation of religion and government. This can refer to reducing ties between a government and a state religion, replacing laws based on scripture with civil laws, and eliminating discrimination on the basis of religion. This is said to add to democracy by protecting the rights of religious minorities. Other scholars, such as Jacques Berlin a blow of the Programme for Jewish Civilization at Georgetown University, have argued separation of church and state is but one possible strategy to be deployed by secular governments. What all secular governments, from the democratic to the authoritarian, share as a concern about relations between church and state. Each secular government may find its own unique policy prescriptions for dealing with that concern. Maharaja Ranjit Singh of the Sikh Empire of the first half 19th century successfully established a secular rule in the Punjab. This secular rule allowed members of all races and religions to be respected and to participate without discrimination in Ranjit Singh Darbar and he had Sikh, a Muslim and a Hindu representatives heading the Darbar. Ranjit Singh also extensively funded education religion, and arts of various different religions and languages. Secularism is often associated with the Age of Enlightenment in Europe and plays a major role in Western society. The principles, but not necessarily practices, of separation of church and state in the United States and law see to copyright in France draw heavily on secularism. Secular states also existed in the Islamic world during the Middle Ages. 
due in part to the belief in the separation of church and state. Secularists tend to prefer that politicians make decisions for secular rather than religious reasons. In this respect, policy decisions pertaining to topics like abortion, contraception, embryonic stem cell research, same-sex marriage, and sex education are prominently focused upon by American secularist organizations such as the Center for Inquiry. Most major religions accept the primacy of the rules of secular, democratic society but may still seek to influence political decisions or achieve specific privileges or influence through church-state agreements such as a concordat. Many Christians support a secular state, and may acknowledge that the conception has support in biblical teachings, particularly the statement of Jesus in the book of Luke, then give to Caesar what is Caesar's, and to God what is God's. However, some Christian fundamentalists oppose secularism, often claiming that there is a radical secularist ideology being adopted in current days and see secularism as a threat to Christian rights, and national security. The most significant forces of religious fundamentalism in the contemporary world are fundamentalist Christianity and fundamentalist Islam. At the same time, one significant stream of secularism has come from religious minorities who see governmental and political secularism as integral to preserving equal rights. Some of the well-known states that are often considered constitutionally secular are USA, France, India, Mexico, South Korea, and Turkey although none of these nations have identical forms of governance. Secular society, in studies of religion, modern democracies are generally recognized as secular. This is due to the near-complete freedom of religion, and the lack of authority of religious leaders over political decisions. Nevertheless, religious beliefs are widely considered a relevant part of the political discourse in many of these countries. This contrasts with other Western countries where religious references are generally considered out of place in mainstream politics. The aspirations of a secular society could characterize a secular society as one which, refuses to commit itself as a whole to any one view of the nature of the universe and the role of man in it. Is not homogeneous, but is pluralistic. Is tolerant. It widens the sphere of private decision making. While every society must have some common aims, which implies there must be agreed on methods of problem solving, and a common framework of law. In a secular society these are as limited as possible. Problem solving is approached rationally, through examination of the facts. While the secular society does not set any overall aim, it helps its members realize their aims. Is a society without any official images? Nor is there a common ideal type of behavior with universal application. Positive ideals behind the secular society, deep respect for individuals and the small groups of which they are a part. The quality of all people. Each person should be helped to realize their particular excellence. Breaking down of the barriers of class and caste. Modern sociology has, since Max Weber, often been preoccupied with the problem of authority in secularized societies and with secularization as a sociological or historical process. Twentieth-century scholars whose work has contributed to the understanding of these matters include Carl L. Becker, Carl L. Paragraph with, Hans Blumenberg, M. H. Abrams, Peter L. Berger, Paul Barr copyright Nietzsche and D. L. Munby, among others. Some societies become increasingly secular as the result of social processes, rather than through the actions of a dedicated secular movement. This process is known as secularization. Secular Ethics George Halayowicz's 1896 publication English Secularism defines secularism as Secularism is a code of duty pertaining to this life, founded on considerations purely human, and intended mainly for those who find theology indefinite or inadequate, unreliable or unbelievable. Its essential principles are three, the improvement of this life by material means. That science is the available providence of man. That it is good to do good. Whether there be other good or not, the good of the present life is good, and it is good to seek that good. Halayowicz held that secularism and secular ethics should take no interest at all in religious questions, and was thus to be distinguished from strong free thought and atheism. In this he disagreed with Charles Bradlaugh, 
and the disagreement split the secularist movement between those who argued that anti-religious movements and activism was not necessary or desirable and those who argued that it was. Contemporary ethical debate is often described as secular, with the work of Derek Parfit and Peter Singer, and even the whole field of contemporary bioethics, having been described or self-described as explicitly secular or non-religious. American Interpretation of Secularism it has been argued that the definition of secularism has frequently been misinterpreted. In a 2012 Huffington Post article titled Secularism is Not Atheism, Jack Berliner Blow, director of the Program for Jewish Civilization at the Edmund A. Walsh School of Foreign Service at Georgetown University, wrote that secularism must be the most misunderstood and mangledism in the American political lexicon. Commentators on the right and the left routinely equate it with Stalinism. Nazism and Socialism, among other dreaded isms. In the United States, of late, another false equation has emerged. That would be the groundless association of secularism with atheism. The religious right has profitably promulgated this misconception at least since the 1970s. Secularist website Concordat Watch also backed the notion that secularism has at times been mistaken as a word that reflects one's personal religious views stating that some opponents of church-state separation redefine a euro o secularism a euro as a euro o state neutrality a euro to allow their group, among others, to get state funding. Others try to discredit it by conflating a euro o secularism a euro with a euro o etism a euro. But it's a political, rather than a religious doctrine and its purpose is to help level the playing field in order to give a better chance for human rights. Organizations Groups such as the National Secular Society and Americans United Campaign for Secularism are often supported by humanists. In 2005, the National Secular Society held the inaugural Secularist of the Year Awards ceremony. Its first winner was Mayam Lamazi, of the Worker Communist Party of Iran, and of the Council of Ex-Muslims of Britain which aims to break the taboo that comes with renouncing Islam and to oppose apostasy laws and political Islam. The Scottish Secular Society is active in Scotland and is currently focused on the role of religion in education. In 2013 it raised a petition at the Scottish Parliament to have the Education Act 1980 changed so that parents will have to make a positive choice to opt into religious observance. Another secularist organization is the Secular Coalition for America. The Secular Coalition for America lobbies and advocates for separation of church and state as well as the acceptance and inclusion of secular Americans in American life and public policy. While Secular Coalition for America is linked to many secular humanistic organizations and many secular humanists support it, as with the Secular Society, some non-humanists support it. Local organizations work to raise the profile of secularism in their communities and tend to include secularists, free thinkers, atheists, agnostics, and humanists under their organizational umbrella. Student organizations, such as the Toronto Secular Alliance, try to popularize non-theism and secularism on campus. The Secular Student Alliance is an educational non-profit that organizes and aids such high school and college secular student groups. In Turkey, the most prominent and active secularist organization is Atata One Quarter AK Thought Association, which is credited for organizing the Republic Protests a Euro demonstrations in the four largest cities in Turkey in 2007, where over two million people, mostly women, defended their concern in and support of secularist principles introduced by Mustafa Kemal Atata One Quarter AK. Leicester Secular Society founded in 1851 is the world's oldest secular society. See also Notes References Further reading, Secular Ethics, Berliner Blow, Jack the Secular Bible, Why Non-Believers Must Take Religion Seriously ISBN 0-521-61824X, Berliner Blow, Jack, How to Be Secular, a Call to Arms for Religious Freedom ISBN 978-0-547-47334-5, Boyer, Pascal. Religion Explained, The Evolutionary Origins of Religious Thought. ISBN 0-465-00696-5, Kleitscher, Paul.
the secular outlook, in defense of moral and political secularism. ISBN 978-1-4443-3521-7, Dacey, Austin. The Secular Conscience, Why Belief Belongs in Public Life. ISBN 978-1-59102-604-4, Halayawak, G. J. The Origin and Nature of Secularism. London, Watts and Company, Reprint, ISBN 978-1-174-50035-0, Jacoby, Susan. Free Thinkers, A History of American Secularism. New York, Metropolitan Books. ISBN 0-8050-7442-2, Nash, David. Secularism, Art and Freedom. London, Continuum International. ISBN 0-7185-1417-3, Royal, Edward. Victorian Infidels, The Origins of the British Secularist Movement, 1791 Euro 1866. Manchester, Manchester University Press. ISBN 0-7190-0557-4 Online Version, Royal, Edward. Radicals, Secularists and Republicans, Popular Free Thought in Britain, 1866 a Euro 1915. Manchester, Manchester University Press. ISBN 0 7190 0783 6. Asset, Talal. Formations of the Secular, Christianity, Islam, Modernity. Stanford University Press. ISBN 0 8047 4768 7. Taylor. Charles. A Secular Age. Cambridge, The Belknot Press of Harvard University Press. ISBN 978-0-674-02676-6, Secular Society, see also the references list in the article on secularization, Berger, Peter L. The Sacred Canopy, Elements of a Sociological Theory of Religion. Garden City, New York, Doubleday. 1990 edition, ISBN 978-0-385-07305-9. Chadwick, Owen. The Secularization of the European Mind in the Nineteenth Century. Cambridge University Press. ISBN 978-0-521-39829-9, Cox, Harvey. The Secular City. Secularization and Urbanization in Theological Perspective. Edition from 1990, ISBN 978-0-02-031155-3, Cosmin, Barry A. and Ariella Kiza. Secularism and Secularity, Contemporary International Perspectives. Institute for the Study of Secularism in Society and Culture. ISBN 978-0-9794816-0-4. ISBN 0-9794816-0-0. Martin, David. A General Theory of Secularization. Oxford, Blackwell. ISBN 0-631-18960-2. Martin, David. On Secularization, Towards a Revised General Theory. Aldershot, Ashgate. ISBN 0-7546-5322-6, McLeod, Hugh. Secularization in Western Europe, 1848-1914. Euro Basingstoke, Macmillan. ISBN 0-333-59748-6. Wilson, Brian. Religion in Secular Society. London, Penguin. King, Mike. Secularism. The Hidden Origins of Disbelief. Cambridge, James Clark and Company. ISBN 978-0-227-17245-2, Secular State, Ada Plus or Minus Var, Halliday Dip. The Turkish Ordeal. The Century Club. ISBN 0 
8305-0057-X, Benson, Ian. Considering Secularism in Pharaohs, Douglas, ed. Recognizing Religion in a Secular Society McGill Queen's Press. ISBN 0-7735-2812-1, Berliner Blow, Jack, How to Be Secular, A Call to Arms for Religious Freedom ISBN 978-0-547-47334-5, Blancart, Roberto. Religion, Church, and State in Contemporary Mexico in Randall, Laura. Changing Structure of Mexico, Political, Social, and Economic Prospects. Columbia University Seminar. Second ed. Emmy Sharp. Chapter 23, PPA 424 Euro 437. ISBN 978-0-7656-1405-6. Sanaa, Alev. Modernity, Islam, and Secularism in Turkey, Bodies, Places, and Time. University of Minnesota Press. ISBN 0-8166-4411-X, Kleicher, Paul. The Secular Outlook, in Defense of Moral and Political Secularism. ISBN 978-1-4443-3521-7, Joa Gensmeer, Mark. The New Cold War? Religious Nationalism Confronts the Secular State. University of California Press. ISBN 0-520-08651-1, Schmidt, Carl M. Catholic Adjustment to the Secular State, The Case of Mexico, 1867-1911. Euro Catholic Historical Review, Vol. 48, July, PPA 182-204. Euro Urban, Greg. The Circulation of Secularism. International Journal of Politics, Culture and Society, Vol. 21 December PPA 17 a Euro 37. External links, Ian Benson Considering Secularism, Secularism 101, Religion, Society, and Politics, Secular Sites, SSC Blog on Secularism, Religion, and the Public Sphere.